AI is everywhere. It's the buzzword with every tech and non techy person. Everybody is talking about AI. And every new software promises you to revolutionize your life by having some form of AI integrated. And every existing app is considered outdated if it doesn't have some kind of AI feature. That's the world we live in now. AI powered, AI focused, everything AI. And with all this AI stuff going on everywhere, the question comes up, have we reached a saturation point? Is AI just wasting our time now? Is it the new social media rather than scrolling through Instagram, we now scroll through AI chats like we scroll through TikTok. Hi there, I'm Yvonne Hyman with AskEvie.com and today we are going to cut through all the buzz and BS. We are getting down to the real deal. No fluff, no empty promises, no hours of optimizing your prompt and spending money to buy other people's prompt, no so-called AI miracles. There's one platform, a platform that is doing what AI promised us to do, giving you your time back. So let's dive right into how ClickUp AI became ClickUp Brain and how it'll give you and your team time back every single day. And if you're ready to claim back all of this admin time and wasted time on digging into how AI works, go hit that like button and claim your time back. We're gonna dive into Click our brain, its features, where to find it, and how technically all of this thing works within ClickUp. And then I will show you real world applications of ClickUp Brain and examples on how it will save you and your time hours every day. And I want to know from you, we're going to go through some examples and all the things, but I want to know from you, what do you wish ClickUp Brain? ClickUp AI could do for you? Pop in the comment section. Now, as you know, we had ClickUp AI for a while now. ClickUp AI has been around in your documents, in your comment section, anywhere you could edit text, you were able to do the slash comment and find AI. It was a lot based of you adding prompts and doing all the things. Now, all of this is still there. However, ClickUp AI now has evolved into ClickUp Brain and it does exactly what the name says. It is your brain of everything that is in ClickUp. So how do you tap into this brain? Really simple actually. When you are in your ClickUp, there is now a button on top that is ClickUp AI. That's how you activate your ClickUp brain. Now when you click that ClickUp AI button, your ClickUp brain is gonna open up. Now here's the first thing you want to pay attention to. Based on where in ClickUp you are right now, it might limit what the AI is grabbing onto. So ClickUp brain knows you are in a specific task right now. So you see that in the AI field, there is a specific location for you chosen. That doesn't mean you have to stick into that. You can easily click out of that. And this is how you can activate ClickUp Brain anywhere and everywhere you are at. No matter if you are in a task, no matter if you are in SmackDap, your ClickUp, no matter if you are in your dashboards, this button is anywhere because it is right on top of your ClickUp. Now, the old way of pulling up ClickUp AI is still there. You still can do the forward slash and pull in your ClickUp AI brain straight up where there is text that works in your documents, that works in your description, that works in your comments. You can do that anywhere and everywhere you want it. Now, you know how to activate your ClickUp AI. You know how to pull it up. You've already seen a couple of ideas in opening up ClickUp Brain where the possibilities are hinted. Now, before we dive into some real world applications of ClickUp AI and the impact ClickUp Brain can have on your business, how about you? Are you like me? You like saving yourself even more time? Subscribe because we have more videos coming up where I share time-saving processes, tools, and workflows with you in the near future. Now, as I already mentioned, when you activate ClickUp Brain and you pull up the AI, you do really want to pay attention if there is a location framework already in there. You can easily exit out, all good. 
not a problem. Now, the fun piece is a lot is already ready for you. So we work a lot in ClickUp. We work a lot with scripting videos, with writing SOPs, with writing out landing pages. All of our brain dumping is happening in ClickUp. And let me let me show you something. This is, this is off script, this is off video. Let me show you something. We have been working on Automate to Dominate and that client persona, that perfect match, that would be the perfect client and would get the most out of our group coaching program, Automate to Dominate, that is coming in April. Now, as you already can see on this menu, there is a lot of information in here. There is a lot of stuff, personal information, business, what do they think? How do they feel? Who is she? Who does she want to become? What is she experiencing? There's a lot of stuff going on in here. Now, if I pull up AI, you might already see some things in here of, okay, what's the purpose? What are the action items? What decisions? You can also easily go into and be like, okay, what are the key takeaways? Or you can ask Clicker Brain to put together what what is the context of this what resources are needed what what is that summary that goes past just a regular summary and now suddenly right there i don't have to go through this 43000 43000 4300 4300 Welcome to a German dealing with American numbers. 4,300 word document. I don't have to dive deep into this to get an understanding of it. I can just keep it here to then dive deep into it when I need to build the landing page and really need the specifics of it. Now you also can pop into here and be like, cool. We have this persona down, everything is done. Kitty is actually working on the landing page, plus social media content, plus the podcast, plus all the things that are happening while we are getting this launch ready. So let's write up a stand up for Kitty so I don't have to be like, what, what are you working? What are you going where? So let's see what comes up in the short form of what has Kitty been up to? And what ClickUp Brain does is based up on your statuses, based up on your communication, based up on context and comments and all the things, it puts together a write-up. Now, I know that Kitty is hands down and she's not gonna be in ClickUp when she's writing this landing page. She prefers Word first and then we put it into ClickUp to have that as a resource. However, as you can tell, she's already been working on this video that I'm recording right now to get things done with updating everything, with getting the due dates updated and all the things. While I stay here, let's see what does Yvonne need to do next? Yes, you can write it out. However, you also can just go right in here. What tasks am I working on? What should I work on next? What tasks are popular based on your team working on tasks? All of the things are possible for you right in here, already ready to go. You don't even have to type it in. And as you can see, this task is due today by 3 a.m. Um, working on it right now. Way to call me out. Thanks a lot. And yes podcast recording is coming up today too. Now we are doing a lot of content creation within ClickUp. So let me show you something else. Yes, we have a specific view where I can see this based on a status, but I want to give you an AI example right here in ClickUp Brain to show you other things of how ClickUp Brain and the AI integration can work with you in here. Now, I already approved all of the short form videos yesterday that were in proof status that I had to check to make sure social media posts and all of this is done, which is why it's like, nope, we don't have any tasks. We are all good. And last but not least, we all want to save some time, right? So let me grab another one. Just for the sake of you seeing you can do this anywhere and everywhere, let's go into everything and let's run it right here. Look, it's right there too. What are our most repetitive tasks across our team? And can you please list them for me? Where I'm going with this is the most repetitive tasks are the tasks 
you want to automate the tasks that you want to template, the tasks that you want to automatically assign time estimates and assignees and all the things. And here we go. So what is ClickUp Brain telling us? There are no specific tasks identified to the most repetitive across the team. However, there are several tasks related to content creation, podcast production, and client management. Correct, because we already automated the task creation and all that things. There's nothing left for us to automate. And this is how ClickUp AI and ClickUp Brain across your whole ClickUp workspace now can help you to not bother your team. Hey, what are you up to? What are you not up to? You don't even necessarily have to build a lot of custom views anymore for all the different situations. You can just pop into AI and say, hey, I want this. Hey, I want that. Click up custom views are still amazing, just as amazing as dashboards are to get a specific view for a specific use case scenario. But for those one-offs, you don't need it anymore. You now have ClickUp Brain and the integrated AI that will help you do all of this. And if you want to dive into AI tools that are seriously helping you be more productive and that are not just fluff and all the, yeah, let's figure this out and let's go down the rabbit hole. I have five AI tools right here that make you a productive wizard, queen, badass bitch, whatever you want to call yourself to save you hours every single day toward all of your workflows and don't forget to subscribe. I want to see you in the next video when I save you again, time and money.